Um, I wanted to say something about uh, something that's not in this conversation. It should be. It's scale. Now, I, I sent Luke a, a chart from Reddit. It's from based on U.S. Census data. Percentage of U.S. women who have never married by age, 1980 and 2015. This, this chart is absolutely shocking. That uh, effectively, uh, the numbers have doubled or more than doubled. And when you get to women over the age of 30, yeah, they have definitely doubled. Now, you want to talk transaction here? Okay. Uh, let's talk about a, a college-educated woman. Uh, who makes uh, economic decisions in her uh, own favor as she sees them. Why does she want to take a risk on marriage? Why does she want to lose income by having children, to fall out of a career track by having children? Uh, isn't it better for her to uh, have a series of affairs and to uh, have some nice things and to post pictures of Instagram of, look, here I am in various foreign cities. And, ooh, look at this expensive cocktail I'm drinking. And, ooh, look at this exotic food that I'm eating, food that you breeder women couldn't possibly afford. And look at how good I look in my clothing, even at the age of 35. Now, if we want to go down the transaction route, one kind of wonders why anyone still gets married. But that's why we have to get away from transactional thinking. So much of what we do in life does not return to us a direct benefit. It doesn't. We have to stop thinking like that. 